My name is Adi and I'm a Swedish artist and producer as well. I grew up on a small island in the southeast of Sweden. Uh, I've been writing my own songs for like 10 years or something and I went to school, production school in Stockholm for three years and now I, I only do like performances and, and productions and yeah, under my own name, Adi. Yeah. I've been in the music business for like three years or something, come, uh, traveling around the world, meeting people. This will all pass by. I am strong enough to carry you, babe. We take off to a place without any pain. Yes, we will. You just have to trust me when I say that today. Well, Eddie is is wonderful. Um, and the great thing is, she's so versatile. She can sing. She can rap. She's uh, she's got seriousness behind her voice. She can also. She's a very strong woman. She, she gives that across, but she's also like a heart of gold, and she can sing that. There's harmony. She's so versatile as a as a singer. She's um, pretty unique lyrically. She can write wonderfully. She can rap. Amazingly, she's got attitude, she's got style, she's got a voice. She's she's a real one of the future generations, one of the bright stars of the future generation. And I'm pleased, so pleased that she's prepared to do all different types of projects. I will release my my debut album in September this year, and then we will release the next album next year. So we there's a lot of songwriting going on right now. I think people who don't know me and my music should listen to my song Woman. Uh, I released it two years ago and it was the anthem song to one of the world's largest conferences in gender issues. And it's a song about women but also about uh, something horrible like ab uh, domestic abuse and I think it's it's very much me, not not the subject in general, but, but it, I mix like rap and, and vocals in a very nice way in, in that song, so I think that's the, the main song for me, actually. Well, the first time I heard about Adi uh, was from our guitarist, Yuan Oyan. Uh, she was, um, you know, an up-and-coming star who had begun to make an impact in the States and Canada and she could sing as well as rap, which was ideal for the song. Beach Function is a Swedish band that is doing jazz music in a funk way, I think. And I met them last fall and they asked me to join the, the album Green Man. And since I knew who they were before and I really enjoy their music, I. I I didn't hesitate to say yes. <laughs> and I was very happy to, to be invited to, to work with them because they have released so much music before and they've worked so, so hard on, on albums, previously albums. And I've, I've learned a lot to work with Daniel and, and the band and performing with them has been great. Since they, they have so much knowledge and experience, they can like, pass on to me. <laughs>
Okej, okay. då kör vi från refrängen. En, två, tre, sorry. En, två, tre, Beat Function's music is, for me, like jazz, funk. Uh, but I also think when they have like vocalists on, it's it's more like soulful than, than only the tracks that are instrumental. And you like it? I like it, yeah, I like it a lot. <laughs> a day is a new artist for me. Daniel actually introduced her sound to me and I thought she was really perfect for the project. She was going to be performing at CMJ New York and that gave me an opportunity to get really familiarized with her music. I think she's a good choice for this project. The combination of the hip-hop and the rap really adds an edginess to the tune that she's on. I think also too the strength that she has exhibited and the, the powerful feminine that she has going on is a real additive to Beat Function's sound. My song on the new album is called Paper Girl and it's about the ideals in this society today that girls have to be like really perfect all the time and we have to look in a certain way and behave in a certain way and, and act in a certain way. So this song is like a, something about that. It's like you don't have to be the paper girl. You can be the, the girl you're meant to be. What I feel about Adi, besides being a terrific live performer, is her feminist approach, uh, which made her the perfect choice to sing Paper Girl, because that song called for someone with a, you know, distinctly, you know, kind of woman with a fighting spirit. And uh, above all, it's about the obsession of the body, uh, in particular among young girls. We get from, you know, media, papers and everywhere, online, and, and most importantly, uh, it's about the unrealistic ideals, which is what Adi sings at the end of each chorus. Is she real? She's got a smile for everyone. While she's on there every day, waiting for her next prey. I would say Paper Girl. It suits Addy to, to a T because it has that strong female voice and that symbolises her. Um, and it symbolises her strength where she goes from her vocal prowess, which she's so good at, these vocal melodies, and then she hits you with a hard rap. Yeah, I do like a 12 bars rap in the song and I wrote that lyrics myself and it was really easy to write that lyrics because it was in a subject that I really care about, you know, that girls have to be able to be whoever they want to be and if they want to be beautiful, they, of course you can be beautiful but it, it's not the main reason that we are here to be like pretty, so that's the lyrics, yeah. <laughs> My point of view as a female, uh, of course, I can bring bring the female perspective into the song. Because since Dan Daniel wrote the other lyrics in, in the song, it's kind of it has to be a girl that sings it because it would be weird otherwise, I think. So I think I, I want to bring my my voice and the soulfulness that I have in my in my voice and some attitude as well. I hope. <laughs> What does Green Man mean to you? What Green Man means to me, I think it's, you know, in some parts of life you just have to wait and wait and wait and when you finally get the green light you just want to rush into something. But, but Green Man for me is like you can enjoy, enjoy the green light in your own tempo. You don't have to rush, rush to get it. You have to like live in the moment as well. Wow. 